I can peep bullshit from a mile away, bro. I know when you hating on me. I know when you jealous or envy of me, bro. I can see it. Alright, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another video. Man, it's your boy Broadway. I'm back with another vlog for y'all, man. I ain't gonna lie, I've been lacking the, like the last three days. I haven't been to the gym in three days, so I'm really lacking. I'm slacking. It's time to get back in the gym, man. <laughs> so that's what I'm about to do right now. It is currently 8.08 right now in LA. Um, I haven't Eight besides I had some noodles earlier, but that's pretty much all I had. But after I get done working out and shit, bro, we're gonna sit down and chop it up. We're gonna sit down and talk, bro, cause I ain't gonna lie, bro. I'm gonna be 100, bro. A lot of y'all out there got me fucked up, bro. And when I say y'all, I mean whoever coming at me with bad intentions, bro. You know what I'm saying? If you if you coming at me with good intentions, I'm not speaking on you. I'm only speaking to niggas that really got me fucked up, bro. You know what I'm saying? But we gonna get more into that once I get done with my workout and shit. Let me go, you know what I'm saying? Get right and do my thing. And then I'm gonna order some food and we gonna sit down and we gonna chop it up. Other than that, make sure y'all go ahead and hit that like button. Make sure y'all go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And hit that notification bell so y'all know every time I drop a video. But don't forget to like, bro. It's gonna help boost my videos, bro. Let's go ahead and start this vlog, man. Let's get it. All right, y'all, so I done made it to the gym. It's not a lot of people in here right now, so that's how I like it. Let's go ahead and get this workout in, man. Let's get it. A lot of my arms a little tight right now. Probably should start off a little slow, but it's all good. It's been three days, it'll be all right. y'all we like 20 25 minutes into the workout uh, i'm feeling pretty good right now uh i don't know why i be bullshit i don't know why i just don't come to the gym but i really do love coming to the gym i love working out i hate how it feels sometimes but it's all good it's okay it'd be okay i ain't tripping about that All right, y'all, so I just made it back to the crib. It is currently nine o'clock now in LA. I'm about to get ready to hop in the shower, so fuck all y'all just talking about nigga stink ass, nigga, all this shit like that. Nigga, I'm finna get in the shower. Don't worry about it. I'm just waiting on my Chick-fil-A. It's finna get ready to pull up. I don't wanna hop in the shower and nigga take me downstairs. And now I gotta run downstairs with a towel on and shit. I'm not trying to do that. I'm not trying to flash y'all like that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Not trying to show y'all this, you know. I don't know if y'all can see, bro. But up here is like the mountains and shit like that. You got the uh, 
the hills, houses on the hills and shit. I really love the area I stay in, bro. Shout out to North Hollywood, man. If you ever want to fuck off in North Hollywood, I'm telling y'all, this John Low Key the best spot to come live at in LA, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like straight up, no cap. Right now, I'm walking to the dispensary. I gotta give me some gas so I quick. You feel me? I said I was gonna chill out for about two, three days, but y'all know how that shit go, man. You know what I'm saying? So, it's all good. We straight. We good. But yeah, uh, I ain't finna go too crazy. I'm just probably grab uh, maybe like a little eighth or something. Just something that I can smoke on for right now. Got the tattoo shop over there. Super cuts. Got 7 Eleven. I stay at this bitch every day. I'm at this John every day. No cap. Yeah. Bro. Where is this man at, bruh? Like, damn. Just told the man to exercise. I don't know why he making this shit so hard, bro. I don't see him. Where he at? God, bro. This man finna make me mad, bro. For real, for real. No cap. Mine finna piss me off, bro. Where the fuck you at, bro? God damn, I ain't finna make me snap on this mine ass, fool. Straight up, get my shit. Come on, bro. Thank you. Oh, All right. Hello? Hello? What's up, fool? Mine, I'm for A. Hey, I'm vlogging right now. Actually, it's crazy. I just picked up my Chick fil A, huh? Hey, nah, bro. Rico, Rico turned me up, P. That mine, nah, bro. Like, that shit lit a fire under me, bro, because I'm tired of niggas being on that type of timing, bro. Like, you not finna spaz on me, and then when I turn up, now nah, I need to calm down, bro. I be humble as fuck, bro. I be chill as hell, but how the fuck you gonna tell me, nigga? I wasn't there. I literally ran down and asked y'all where the nigga was, G. And then I left. You constantly ignoring the fact that I asked to see where y'all was before I left. Sometimes niggas just be talking, just be talking because it sound good, bro. Like, I'm like, bro, what are you talking about, Rico? Nigga was just there trying to help you, cuz. When I couldn't find you, or Sino didn't know where, bro, what? I'm not finna stay up there. And he not trying to hear that. That's what be making me mad, bro. Like, it seemed like niggas will exclude anybody else that was a part of the situation and only want to argue with me, bro. I'd be like, what you mean? I'm excluding Sino. I'm just talking to you. Now, what the fuck you mean? It was all three of us on top of the house, cuz. Why is you not, why is you excluding Ceno like Ceno didn't see the shit too? Ceno was right there too, bro. You dropped down, right, you dropped down. I dropped down to see what a nigga was while you was trying to revive him. And then I got out of there, cuz shit, at that point, I don't see, bro. And I, you are. Rico already down, cuz. You trying to revive him, you can die like that too. What you want me to die to? Come on, man. Like, that, I'm like, Rico, what is you talking about, bro? You know how I many times we all leave each other at certain times, bro, when it's time for it, bro. You feel me? Like, nigga, it's a time to run, it's, it's a time to push. Simple. Bro, because every time niggas come flying in on top of that hoe, they finna do some damage, cuz. I done died up here too many times trying to get some loot, bro. You feel what I'm saying? I'm trying to get the loot and dip and meet they ass at the bottom. You wanna fight at the top. But yeah, nah, that's all good. I mean, it's still my boy, but nah, Rico had to feel me on that one, cuz. Fuck is you talking about, bro? Alright, y'all, so I'm back. My fucking camera died, bro. I done already devoured my food. Y'all ain't get to see that. I'm sorry. I know y'all like to watch me eat. You know what I mean? I don't know why, but y'all like to. Um, well, it's a reminder to me, but a message to y'all. You feel me? And I just basically want to let niggas know, like, bro, stop playing with me, bro. Like, stop, bro. Like, I'm really him, bro. 
Like a lot of niggas now that I'm so humble, bro. I'm so humble, bro. To the point where I may be too humble. And that's a problem, bro, because some of you niggas take my niceness for granted, dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm with all smoke if it's coming my way, bro. But I'm not going starting shit with nobody, bro. I don't start shit with nobody, bro. You know what I'm saying? I hate talking to people that never take accountability. I hate talking to people that can never uh, be wrong. I hate talking to people that think they know every fucking thing, bro. Like, bro, like, for real. Like, y'all niggas got to stop that shit, bro. Like, for now on, bro, I'm just finna be at a point like, bro, why am I even arguing with you? Like, you ain't even living better than me. You ain't getting more money than me. You ain't getting more bitches than me. You ain't traveling like me. Like, bro, like, it's a lot of shit, bro. Like, a lot of niggas ain't doing, bro. And I swear to God, bro, I be so humble, bro. I really try not to pop my shit, bro. But I really feel like some of y'all really need to see that side of me, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, I really try to be humble, bro. And niggas be thinking I ain't got no motion. Niggas think I ain't really got shit going, bro. Like, what, nigga? Who? <laughs> bro, do y'all, bro. I just got to remind niggas, bro. You know what I'm saying? For real. Like, I just got to remind you niggas, bro. Like, I'm really him, bro. Stop fucking playing with me, bro. Like, I do this shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I done made it this far in life, bro, because I really do this shit, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm tired of the slick shade. I'm tired of niggas throwing out that small little slick ass shit. You know what I'm saying? That snake ass shit. My nigga peeped that shit from a mile away, bro. I got great discernment, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I can peep bullshit from a mile away, bro. I know when you hating on me. I know when you jealous or envy of me, bro. I can see it. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times people don't even be knowing. But it's really in your actions, bro. You know what I'm saying? If you're a person with discernment, you can see that shit from a mile away, bro. I peep the bullshit. Like, bro, a lot of times people get mad because I cut them off way before they can do me wrong, bro. But that's because I already peep what you got going on, bro. You ain't, it ain't true intentions. It ain't good intentions. I only fuck with people that got good intentions, bro. That's right with God, bro. Like, I ain't with none of you demon-ass people, bro. I don't fuck with y'all, bro. It's a reason why I be to myself, bro. I just don't fuck with y'all, bro. You feel what I'm saying? But, like, I just had to, bro, like, at the end of the day, bro, and this is a message to anybody out there as well, bro. If you got people that's playing with you, like, you really not that person, bro, show them, bro. You know what I'm saying? And what I mean when I show them, you ain't just got to talk. Show it in your actions, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, a motherfucker say whatever they want about me, bro. You see how I'm living now? You see where I'm at? You see where I came from? Like, come on, bro. Like, I'm really from Memphis, Tennessee, bro. From the trenches, dog. You know what I'm saying? Like, I lived on both sides. I stayed in the hood and I stayed middle class, bro. So I got to live both sides. You feel me? Thank God. You feel me? So they able... That was able to show me what I wanted to do in life, you know what I'm saying? Because I could have chose to stay and do shit in the hood. Or I can choose to be a person in middle class and be a good civilian and do this, that, and the third. You feel me? So, like, at the end of the day, a lot of niggas don't get that option. I got that option. And if you if you watching this right now, you, nigga, if you got the option to see both sides. Because some niggas don't get to see both sides, bro. Some niggas wish they could see the other side sometimes. You feel what I'm saying? So if you is a nigga that was able to see both sides and you still choose the lifestyle that ain't best for you or your family, then by all means, bro, niggas shouldn't have no sympathy for you. For real, niggas shouldn't have no sympathy for you. For real, bro. I'm just speaking facts, dog. You know what I'm saying? But, like, I'm done, bro. I'm done with that humble shit, bro. I'm just going to be me, bro. And I just want people to understand, bro. It's all respectfully, bro. I'm respectfully being me, bro. Unapologetic. Unapolo unapologetically. You feel me? Like, that's just what it is going forward, bro. Like, I can't sit here and continue to let niggas think that I'm not him, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm really like that, bro. You feel me? I'm God's child, bro. I'm a chosen one, nigga. I'm on a mission, dog. I'm not like everybody else, bro. 
You know what I'm saying? When you come across me, if you a evil person, if you a demon, if you any type of, if you don't do anything for God, bro. If you just a person that just ain't right, being around me is going to rub you the wrong way, bro. You know why? Because I'm pure hearted, nigga. I'm pure hearted, nigga. God know my heart. I'm genuine as fuck, nigga. You know what I'm saying? But when niggas get on my bad side or cross that line, bro, we got to go there, bro. You know what I'm saying? But I don't like going on that side like that, bro, because I try to be at peace. I, I try to spread love to everybody, bro, because everybody deserve it. You feel what I'm saying? But some niggas just be making you just want to get on their ass. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, bro, like, I'm just at a point now, bro, like, I'm tired of you niggas thinking, like, y'all niggas is better than me, bro. You not. Especially the niggas I know ain't nowhere near on my level, bro. For real. I'm speaking facts, bro. Straight facts. You know what I'm saying? And this video I ain't targeted towards Nobody specifically, bro. It's a message to everybody, bro. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, bro. I treat you with respect. You treat me with respect, bro. You know what I'm saying? Simple, bro. I'm only going to give out what you give, bro. If you come in with that type of energy, what you think I'm coming with? I mean, I'm just being honest, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, all my life growing up, I was a people pleaser, bro. Like, that's odd, bro. Like, I just wanted to make sure you was good, even if I feel bad, nigga. At the end of the day, being a people pleaser, bro, let me tell you something, bro. Being a people pleaser, bro, will fuck you up in the long run, bro. So, if you watching this right now, bro, if you just got to make people happy, bro, and I mean, you just don't want them upset, you don't never want to confront no bullshit, you don't never want to do confrontation, none of that shit, Man, I'm telling you, bro, that shit gonna hurt you in the long run, bro. You might wanna drop that shit right now. You feel me? Once I drop that people pleasing shit, my life drastically changed, bro. For the better. I promise you. It did, because I started taking care of me, bro. And making sure I'm good. Okay, how I feel about this shit? Do I feel disrespected? Did they cross the boundary? Did they, you know what I'm saying? When I start asking myself them type of questions, bro, I ain't out here trying to be no tough guy, bro. I'm not on this shit, bro, to be no motherfucking tough guy, bro. I ain't no shooter. You know what I'm saying? But as a man, bro, you just, come on, bro. Like, be 100, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, I ain't going. You know what I'm saying? So, if you watching this video, man, you feeling like me right now, man, smash that motherfucking like button, bro. You know what I'm saying? Because niggas is really playing with us out here. Like, we really not like that. I don't care what you do, my nigga. Play sports, hoop, play football, baseball, nigga. If you run track, nigga. If you a fucking artist, you if you in school. You know what I'm saying? Getting a degree. Like, you got to understand, bro. It's some niggas wish they was you, bro. They'll never tell you that, though. You know what I'm saying? They'll never tell you that. But they wish they was you, bro. You know what I'm saying? I'm telling y'all, bro. I'm still humble, bro. I'm not going to let that shit take away my humbleness. But I'm done being too humble, bro. Me being too humble... It's not really getting me in the spaces I need to be because some spaces require you to pop your shit and let motherfuckers know that you really like that, that you can really bring something to the table or you really got an idea or you can really bring value. Like sometimes you just got to do that. You know what I'm saying? Like sometimes you can't fall back when niggas is looking for help. Sometimes, you know, for me, bro, I remember, bro, like I used to have a problem with like if I was better than you. Or if, like, I knew that I, like, for instance, like, I would have people that I used to kick it with, and I knew, like, mindset-wise, I was better than them. Because I always wanted to elevate, and they didn't. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like when you got that type of mindset, bro, and you around the wrong people, bro, it's just, it's not going to work, bro. You know what I'm saying? And niggas know. Niggas be knowing. Even your friend group you got right now, nigga. I guarantee you, nigga. If you the misfit out the group, nigga. If you the nigga that got the dreams, the goals. And you really going after it. Not niggas just talking about it. But if you really going after your shit, bro. I guarantee you them niggas be feeling some type of way, bro. You know what I'm saying? And a nigga can still love you. You feel what I'm saying? But it's just like some niggas can't fathom like how you made it and they didn't, bro. How you get out and they didn't. How you get blessed and they didn't. 
You feel me? But, you know, when you God's child, bro, when you on a mission, bro, when you a chosen one, that favor just come. You know what I'm saying? That's just what it is, bro. You feel me? And if you're going to be on this mission and you want to be great in life, bro, jealousy, envy, entitlement, all that shit come with this shit, bro. And we just got to be ready. You feel me? Like, I'm really speaking to y'all right now. I'm really talking to y'all right now. Just letting y'all know, bro. Like, let's go, man. Hey, turn the fuck up and show these for who the fuck you really is, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, stop all the bullshit. Stop playing. Stop, you know what I'm saying? Like, I try to be as humble as possible. And I'm going to continue to be. But we're going we gonna to let up on the humbleness a little bit. You feel me? And we're going to pop our shit for the rest of 2023. You feel me? So make sure y'all like this motherfucking video if you haven't already. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe. Make sure you go ahead and hit that notification bell. You feel me? I'm finna finish smoking that blunt. Probably hop on some Fortnite or some shit like that. But yeah, man, I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog, man. I'll see y'all in my next video, man. God. <laughs> Peace.